What's good, y'all? It's your boy, Jarrell. Back with another fucking video. Uh, when is when this death shit gonna stop? When this shit is gonna stop? Let's be real. In case y'all don't know what happened Monday on um, PNB Rock. If y'all don't know who this is, go and check out his old shit from 2015 to 2016 all the way to 2017. This man, Selfish, if you never heard of Selfish and fucking Horse on the Fast and the Furious track, and he did a feature with, um, with Meek Mill and them and XX to touch y'all. Make sure y'all check that out. He's a talented rapper. I've listened to him for a while. Um, case y'all didn't know what happened, and I know y'all already know what happened. It's pretty fucked up what happened. So basically, PNB Rock got shot and, and he got killed. In the restaurant, when his girl, when his girlfriend was in a restaurant with him, so basically he was going to get some chicken and waffles. He about to join the meal, you know. He got to get something to eat. So basically, if you don't know what happened, the reason how he got shot because his girlfriend, basically his girlfriend, posted a location where they was at on Instagram, and then people talk, and then people were trying to defend her, talking about some old oh, like she didn't mean to do it. Everybody said, people said this is her second time doing this shit. This is what I heard now. I'm not from LA, but, you know, but it's just, it's a sad situation. We just lose another rapper every day, the day after day after day after day. This man got shot when he was on a, de a date with his girlfriend, basically eating dinner with his girlfriend, food, whatever. And this man, we don't know how many times he got shot. We just know he got shot and he pronounced dead. And it's a sad situation because he was a talented rapper, bro. He seems like he seems like a chill dude, like a chill laid back dude. And then he deleted her Instagram before, but she got that shit back. But the reason why I want to talk to y'all about this because I'm gonna say this to all the ladies and fellas, bro. And it's not gonna be just all. It's gonna be all of y'all people, bro. Yo, let's be real, bro. If you had a dream and goal, if you're a freaking rapper, bro. If you're a famous celebrity, if you're a rapper, she or he, whatever, if you hang out with somebody, bro, if you have a girlfriend, if you know your nigga is a hood dude, bro, don't post this shit on Instagram and then tag it, the location. Because, bro, people losing too many lives like this, bro. And we already know what happened to Pop Smoke, one of my favorites. God bless, rest his soul, Pop Smoke. Shut up, the big woo, rest in peace. Hand in God. Like... But don't sit here and act like we don't get, do this every day. And I know she she feel bad right now, cause you post the you post the location where y'all was eating at, and then we don't even know if people was out people was in there. We already know people was in there, but we don't know if somebody was in that car. One of his homeboys said, "Yo, like, all right, bro, P and B Rock is in here, bro. The famous rapper in here, bro. Hey, man, we he got jewelry here. His girlfriend, bro. Let's go ahead and rob this man and take his jewelry, bro. I'm just tired of seeing rappers dying that is talented and successful, and they just minding their own business. I never had P and B Rock in a beef. We never had this man in a beef, bro." We never hear this man in a beef. But it always got to be the niggas that always hang on, on people that are successful and humble. And try to get out the And they live in better lives, bro. And he ain't did nothing. This man was just eating chicken and waffles. And next thing you know, they just shoot this man and rob him of his jewelry. And a Rolex. And y'all broke people act like y'all can't work hard for it. Y'all like to take everything away from people that they work hard for it. Work hard for, bro. And be humble. Like, it's always people that always hating. It's always people jealous of the person that having a good life. And they work hard for it and they earn it. And they making that money. And living their dream come true, bro. And then they famous. They want to sell many records. And they doing music for, for, for the fans that we listen to. And y'all want to take off every rappers away, and then people want to have a problem with it, and they don't give a fuck, bro. And the situa it's the same situation of Pop Smoke, bro. Like, I love Pop Smoke. I love Pop Smoke. One of my favorites, bro. I fuck with Pop Smoke heavy, bro. Like, real heavy. Like, 
And then people were talking about some, oh, why he didn't have security cards, bro. Like bodyguards. Dude. Shut y'all dudes who say he should have had bodyguards from y'all need to shut the hell up with that because you never know. He tried to he tried to probably live his life, bro. You never know if you need a bodyguards or not. He probably didn't have a bodyguard. Matter of fact, bro, people over here talking about something. He probably didn't have a bodyguard. That's his fault. It wasn't his kind of his fault. Because people probably cause this girl posted location up there and people talking about so no she did it. She just posted the ad, she just posted she just posted the restaurant name. Dude. Listen to y'all dumb, y'all dumb fucks right now. Y'all listen, whoever say that shit, cause I seen people on social media talking about some, in the comments talking about some. Oh, this dude. Oh, oh, she didn't, she didn't post the location. She just post the restaurant name, dude. She have to post the right location. She have to post the right restaurant where they at, and that's how they get the location. And they click on the lo, cl lo the the name restaurant name, and they give them the location where they at. It's the same situation of Snapchat and Instagram. Instagram. For the same shit for the Snapchat, they have that big behind map where you tell you where you're at and you can share your location with them. <sighs> but, and ladies, I might say all these, but men, and this is the same for niggas here too, for people, my black brothers and sisters and my women, my beautiful sisters and my black brothers, for, for the, my black brothers, bro, don't sit here and post your location where you at and you having a beef with somebody, if you're a famous rapper, and I say anybody, if y'all, all y'all could be a famous rapper, bro, don't post your location on there talking about, so I'm out here, like, oh, I'm out here, like, where y'all people at, bro, I'm out here, bro, I'm not scared of y'all, and the next thing you know, you get shot the next day. A rapper had, a, not, a rapper had did that before, I, like, a rapper did that before, talking about, so I'm not scared of my ops, I'm home right now, pull up, and the, the man got shot because he dumped behind and posted the damn location. Like, I don't wish nobody on no death, bro. And the, I'm sorry I have an upload for a while. I was supposed to upload for y'all that Friday. Now it's Monday. The reason why I didn't upload for y'all Friday because 2K, NBA 2K, I was supposed to upload for y'all NBA 2K23 Challenge of Michael Jordan. Basically, y'all, uh, um, I have to wait for two, day, for two days to get my NBA 2K23. I was not getting the regular edition. I was not getting the Michael Jordan edition. I was getting the championship edition for the PS5. And I had the money for it. I went to GameStop Friday. And they said they ran out and sold out. And they told me something they might be delayed. But the funny part is, Ronnie 2K, and I'm pissed off with this. Two, Ronnie 2K, how you making all that money? And then you posting this shit on Snapchat and all the way to Instagram. And TikTok said, come get y'all 2Ks. Basically, first of all, the game haven't came out yet. The game was regularly supposed to come out on Friday. But y'all released it early on Thursday for the people that... that Got to early and pre order it. I know that's true. And I'm not wrong. I'm not having a problem with that. But you sitting here giving people like celebrities, like rappers, these games and YouTubers, these games early and they already are level 40, bro. And I'm not hating. I'm just mad because why y'all doing that? But I understand the celebrities going to get a free copy. Same, like, that's the when it first they made 2K21 for the next gen. That was the first next gen game for, on PS5 for the 2K. Y'all gave. Travis Scott, he already played the game. And that's what I'm saying, 2K. That's not fair. I think that's not fair because people gonna hit Legends already. And then super, the rep was 40 already. And then people don't got a chance to play. And then same for the people who got it early at 8. They don't get off the game. They just be on the game. And they like, don't have a job or nothing, bro. Like, I'm that's what I'm saying, bro. And 2K, bro, please, yo, I'm begging. But please have some more got, goddamn... NBA 2K23 Championship Editions on Michael Jordan just because that don't make no sense how GameStop still don't have no more and they out of stock. Y'all saw like that quick that Friday? Bro, the original game was supposed to come out Friday. I know the early people who pre-ordered the digital. I don't like digital. I don't. I like the CD disc because I like the cases. You know, that's just me, bro. I love the artwork of the cases. That's just me, bro. But 2K, y'all got to do better, bro. And 2K24, whoever y'all put the Legend Edition, like Kobe Bryant. I know somebody. I know people won't put Kobe Bryant again. Because this is going to be Kobe Bryant's third cover or fourth, whatever. Because he's been on 2K21. He's been on 2K21 Mamba Edition. He's been on 2K10. No, 2K10. So this is probably going to be his. No, in 2K17, this probably will be his fourth cover. So he will be tied with Michael Jordan, basically. And 
I just want to say I hope y'all don't run out of the championship edition on Kobe Bryant because I hope y'all have a Kobe Bryant one, whatever, whoever you put on a Kobe ch challenge or whatever. But I'm just saying, bro, like, please stay safe. If you have a girlfriend, bro, if you a celebrity, bro, and then, you know, if you be out the hood, it's for everybody. And don't push your stuff on location because I don't like to see people dying like this. It's sad because people like people dying like this forever. Because we see this every day. We see people dying every day. Let's be real. People, it's going to happen to everybody. It's going to happen. Not just that. It, people going to die in life. It's going to be sad, but that's how the way it is goes, bro. God going to tell you, when, God's going to tell you when you're ready to go up there. But you just got to pray, like pray every day, bro. I pray every day. Make sure you pray to God every day because you will need it. He will always here for you. And, you know, family always here for you. If you have a girl, your girl could be there for you. Because I've been with moms for 10 months. My girl for 10 months. Wow. Graduating with her to everything. I love her to death. But I'm just wanting, I'm just letting y'all know. Make sure y'all stay safe anywhere. Because you, like, anywhere. Because you don't know what's going to happen. Because you, people get killed for no reason, bro. Let's be real. I'm just speaking facts. People get killed everywhere. It ain't going to be anywhere. But it's going to be everywhere, bro. Because they like they hating. They don't like what people, they don't like what our black brothers and sisters shine up. They don't like when we, we shine up and then next thing you know they hang because we have jewelry and shit. I don't know how many times they got shot, but I saw the video that I ain't going to tell you the details because the video had pissed me off because the, on the, I'm going to explain what the video is. He We already know he P, P and B Rock got shot. God bless my soul. At age 30, he can't see his daughter no more and his family no more. And he was too young for that, man. I'm just saying, like, but they're just standing right there, seeing him moving his arm. Like, he moved one of his arm, and I'm, bro, I, I was praying that I hope he could survive it. But, like, man, I mean, her, he couldn't survive it, bro. It's just sad in L.A., bro. It's sad in L.A., bro. It really is, bro. That's, like, like, they see him move his body, and then y'all move him around. Y'all didn't give him no help. Y'all didn't stand on the floor and try to call for, like, I don't know how long the ambulance was there. They probably came late, whatever, or they just didn't took him for a while to come out there. But y'all could have did something to just, like, put something over him. Y'all just let him bleed right there on the floor, and that's sad. And that's and then, and then I'm just let y'all know about this. Y'all kind of fucked up for posting a video on social media, bro, or some real shit. Y'all posting shit on your story. That shit is whack as fuck. Get a life. Y'all need help. Y'all need Jesus. For God's sake, fuck y'all who post that shit because that shit is fucked up. Nobody wants to see the video. Don't sit here and show people the video. I know people want to know what happened. Let's be real. I had no what I would know how I wouldn't have known what happened, but do I want to post the video and show it? No, because that's fucked up. Give some people respect, bro. But man, this is my video, bro. I I might I'm gonna let y'all know why I get 2K. I might do another video while I get 2K23. But it's only Tuesday. Well, in the morning. It's 2.47 in the morning. I'm just chilling. And I might go to bed after this. So I'm just tired a little bit, bro. So I just want to let y'all know, bro. Stay safe out of these people. Because you know how people is. Y'all yeah, might have a stalker that watching you. You never know, bro. Stay safe out there, out of these worlds, bro. Because people, people is weird and crazy and psycho. They would do anything. Anything to you. But I'm just let y'all know I love y'all. Pray to God. Stay safe. Make sure y'all wash your hands. Make sure y'all still wear a mask. I know COVID not that bad. Well, it kind of is, but make sure y'all wash your hands, wear a mask, everything. God bless. I love y'all. Peace.